This is a vinyasa class. So there will be some up, down, push up stuff, um, which you are welcome to do or not. Okay, so just come to your seat, whatever that looks like for you. Close your eyes, rest your palms in your lap or on your thighs or knees. And just take a moment to arrive here on your mat. Check in with how you're feeling, how your body's doing. Stay open to what the practice has in store for you today, letting go of any expectations on what we will be doing. If you can get into a pose or not. Having compassion and patience with your body. If you'd like to send an intention for your practice, you can do that here. Just one word. What do you want to cultivate during your pra practice on and off your mat? Hold your palms together in front of your heart. Inhale. And exhale. Open your gaze, open your eyes, come to your downward facing dog. Fingers spread wide. Shake your head no. Ah, yes. Root down into your first finger and your thumb. Now, Walk your feet up just a touch and as wide as your mat so that your heels can come down. Keep your left hand rooted and your right hand will reach outside your left leg. Bend your right elbow, turn your left armpit down and then take a peek underneath your left armpit up to the sky. Spine is long. And twist. Switch. Right hand forward, left hand wraps around your right leg, little bend in your elbow. Straighten your right arm and turn the armpit down. Peek underneath your right armpit up to the sky. And breathe. Good. Take your left hand out. Walk your feet back to your downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, bend your knees. Take little steps or one big step all the way up to the top of your mat. Inhale, lift halfway. Look forward, long spine. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lift your chest. Lift your gaze. Lift your arms. Look up, palms touch. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, look up, reach up. Exhale, hinge at your hips, fold, press your thighs back. Inhale, lift halfway, look forward. Exhale, step to your plank, top of the push up. Spread your fingers wide. Shift your shoulders over your wrists. Inhale, shift all the way forward, knees might come down. Exhale to the belly. You can keep your elbows a little wide here. Untuck your toes. Inhale, roll on up, cobra. And exhale, release down. Downward facing dog. Lift your right leg. And then knee to nose, shift forward, shoulder over wrist. Lift your hips. Inhale, down dog split, right leg lifts. Exhale, right knee, right elbow. Don't rush this. Inhale, right leg lifts up. Exhale, right knee, left elbow, squeeze, hold, or step your right foot through. Fall in triangle. So you're on the inside edge of your back foot, the outside edge of your right foot. Press the earth away, and then reach back. Open your heart. Good. Take your left hand back down. 
Right leg lifts up, down dog split. Step your foot through your hands. Keep your back knee lifted. Left hand roots down. Right arm reaches up and then just take some circles with the arm. Couple back stroke and front. Gather your belly up. Right hand down. Step to downward dog. Couple rounds of breath. Notice if there's any difference between the sides. And inhale with your left leg. Exhale, knee to nose, shift forward in your plank. Inhale, left leg lifts up. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Gather your belly up, lift your hips. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left knee to right elbow. Step your foot through and come to your fallen triangle. Right arm reaches up. Open up your heart. Root down into your feet. Lift your hips. One more inhale. Exhale, right hand down. Down dog split. Left leg lifts up. And then step your foot through your hands. Right hand stays rooted. Left arm reaches up. Twist. Peel your left hip back, back stroke. And then the other direction. Take your left hand down, downward facing dog. Inhale, shift forward to plank. Knees can come down. Exhale all the way to your belly or to your push up. Inhale, upward facing dog or cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Step your right foot through your hands. Back knee stays lifted. Reach your arms up, crescent. Okay, peel your tailbone down a touch. Take your hands to your heart. Shift forward at your hips. Long torso. And then twist. Left elbow hooks outside of right thigh, right knee. Press your palms together. Draw your thumbs to your sternum. Reach to the crown of your head. Option to open up your arms. Your front hand might come inside your front foot or outside. Right arm reaches up. Lift your hips. Peel your right hip back. Good. Take both hands down. And then straighten your right leg as you lift your left. Keep your left hand rooted there. Right hand, right hip. And then release your left hip down toward your mat. Lift your right arm up. So you're going to revolve half moon. You might have this bottom hand on a block. And your right arm, the one that's reaching up, might be more out like a half letter T. Breathe here. Good. Both hands come down. Left foot steps way back. Downward facing dog. Whew. Inhale, roll forward to plank. Knees can come down or not. Exhale to your push-up. Inhale to upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Step your left foot through your hands. Arms reach up, crescent. Take your hands to your heart. Hinge forward with your torso. And then twist. Right elbow, left thigh. Press your palms together. Draw your thumbs to your sternum. And find your breath. Breathe laterally. Try to keep your rib cap cage expanding. Maybe open up the arms. Gaze can be up or down and breathe. One more inhale. Exhale, both hands come down. Downward facing dog. Actually, step your left foot forward again. Both hands come down. Right leg lifts up. Left leg stays straight. Toes point down on your lifted foot. Keep your right fingertips down on your mat or a block. Left hand, left hip. Reach through your spine and your crown. Left arm can reach up. But if that's not doing anything for you, just keep your left hand down. And one more inhale. Exhale, both hands down. Step your right foot back. Downward facing dog. Inhale, shift forward. Knees might come down. Exhale to your belly. Inhale, up dog. 
exhale, downward facing dog. A couple rounds of breath. Mm. Inhale, lift heels. Exhale, bend knees, step or hop to the top of your mat. Inhale, lift halfway. Exhale, fold. Bend knees, sit hips back, chair pose. Sorry, music issues here. Arms reach up, hands to the heart. Now, reach through your spine and crown, and then take your twist, left elbow, right thigh, Press palms together, sit hips back, like you're on the back of your chair. Reach through your crown, open up your arms. There is an arm balance, take side crow if you like. Breathe. Gather your belly up, big breath in, and fold. Exhale, let it go. Right to the other side, bend knees, sit hips back. Most of the weight in your heels, reach arms up. Hands to heart, right elbow hooks outside the left thigh, thumbs to sternum, sit hips back. Reach through your crown, don't collapse your collarbones. Open up your arms if you like. Take your arm balance if you like, or stay, breathe. Hips back. One more inhale, exhale, release. Whew. Inhale, lift halfway. Exhale, step back, down dog. Step your right foot forward, runner's lunge. And then make sure your feet are hips width distance apart here. Slowly start to straighten your front leg to your ability. And then your back foot is planted down. So you might step it forward just a touch. Right hand or right hip. Peel your right hip back. And then press down into the big toe mounds on both feet. Reach through the crown of your head. Keep your left fingertips down. Keep pressing your right hip back. And then your right arm can go out like a half letter T. Come to your low back or all the way up to the sky. Connect to your breath. Try to lift your pinky toe off the mat. Good. Both knees bend, both hands come down. Step to your down dog. Notice the difference between the sides. And then left foot steps forward. Straighten your front knee. Both feet are down. Back foot faces forward at a 45 degree angle. Left hand, left hip. Press your left hip back. And then walk your hands forward. Nice long spine. Good, left hand can stay on your left hip. Or find Deeper twist, left arm can reach up. Or come to your low back. Keep reaching through the crown of your head and your tailbone. Try to take your tailbone and point it toward your back heel. Good, bend both knees, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift heels. Exhale, bend knees, step or hop to a seat. So come on back with your uh, weight on your sits bones. Take your hands to your heart, feet can stay down. And then you're gonna wedge your left elbow toward the earth, twist. Inhale, come through center. Exhale, twist to your right. Center, exhale, twist left. Center, exhale, twist right. So as long as you can maintain this openness in your collarbones, a nice long spine, maybe lift your shins and twist. Come to center, twist left, come to center, twist right. Good, last two on each side. Last one. Good, take your feet down, scoot your booty up. And come on down to your back, knees to chest. Take some circles. Good, knees to armpits, soles of feet up, grab feet, and rock and roll side to side. Good, 
take both feet down, take your left leg long on your mat, right knee hugs into your chest, left hand outside your right knee, and then cross over your body to the left. Try and let your shoulder blades fall. It's okay if the right one doesn't touch down. Right arm goes out like a half letter T. Gaze to the right, maybe close your eyes. Come back to your back, back through center. Both knees hug in, right leg long. Right hand outside of left thigh, and then cross over your body, gaze to your left. Close your eyes, soften your shoulder blades down. Soften your jaw. Good, roll back to your back, knees come in. Rock and roll up to a seat. Choose to end your practice however you like. Maybe you come to Shavasana or end in meditation. So I'll just let you choose how you want to end your practice. Perhaps you want to add something on. Wherever you're at, try and carry your intention with you off your mat today. Hold your palms together in front of your heart. Inhale, breath. And exhale, release. Thank you so much for practicing with me. Namaste.